Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In case you're new here, my name is Kristen and you are very much welcome to this family. For my returnees, thank you so much for always coming back to support my content. So guys, it's in the morning, it's on a Saturday. Yeah, it's on a Saturday. I want to go and sort out a client who has been pending for quite a long time. Yeah, she wanted curtains and I've, I've kept her um, waiting for like uh, two weeks because I didn't get time to go to Italy due to the job that I was doing. But now that I'm free, I want to go and sort her out. Uh, then I, lucky enough, uh, yeah, I want, let me just say I want to go and sort her out. I want also to, I have a cake order that I need to deliver today. Actually, that order was placed yesterday night. So I had to stay um, late to bake. I, I'm still trying to do this baking thing so i had to bake i couldn't say no to the order so i need to decorate it today and uh, deliver it by two two to that latest uh lucky enough uh it's not far where i need to deliver it's not that far like a, a kilometer so i've just placed an order for pepper toppers so when i come back i think i'll I'll call I'll call them to deliver because I don't think I'll pass by the cake uh, accessory shop. So I'll call them to deliver. Then I will start decorating the cake and uh, deliver it. So that is the plan today. I also need to go to the salon, but I don't think if I'll make it today. Yeah, I don't think if I'll, if I'll make it today, maybe tomorrow or Monday. Yeah, maybe tomorrow or Monday, but we'll see about that. So it's 10. Yeah, it's a bit late. I woke up late. I woke up a bit late. So I by now I should be in Isili because of the cake that I also need to deliver. So let me just rush to Isili and let's see what we'll get. Uh, then come back as fast as possible so that I don't disappoint the other client. Yeah, so that is the update. Please uh, stay tuned, like, share, and uh, comment in the comment section below. You can even leave just a love emoji, and I'll know that you have been there and you have watched uh, this video. Thank you so much, guys. So see you later. So this is a shop in Bangkok Mall and guys I love love the curtains at the top there. Those are three curtains there, the cream, the beige and the grey. They are so cute and the quality of that material is so nice. Actually the price is um, 1800 per meter and that's quite high but I really love the, the texture and the colours and um, the material. Yeah, it's very heavy and uh, 
blackout uh, total blackout curtains i wish i could afford those ones for my for my living room they are very cute yeah so i already uh, cut the material for the curtains that i need and uh, they will just start sewing uh, in a minute lucky enough uh, there are no many customers so i will just i uh, will wait for like um maximum one hour and they will be done these are the other curtains guys see this curtain how cute it is this curtain is very nice especially if you have a white seat or a gray seat it is very very nice yeah these curtains are very cute if you can afford them kindly get them and if you want to if you want curtains and you can't um get to easily please uh don't hesitate to contact me i will do the errands for you i'm back in business here yeah, and i'm available anytime any day So I'm back home. I just got home and uh, decorated this cake very fast. So I just want to package to package it so that I can take it to the to my to my client. Yeah, I don't want to keep her waiting. She will be cutting this cake for her son. Uh, for her son uh, at around four four thirty uh, p.m. I've never been exposed like this before I'm gonna try to get you out I've always had a way of keeping close Beating, hiding, I've been calling out your name from the darkness Thinking it's too late If you're fine Today let's clean uh, some curtains. So it's been a while since I cleaned these uh, curtains and my bedroom curtains. And the good thing with these white curtains, this material, guys, if you want white curtains and you are you live in a dusty place like I do, kindly get this material. It does not get dirty, guys. Okay, it gets dirty, but it does not show the dirt. Yeah. So. You can get this and it won't fail you. So when I was getting the white curtains, I was so afraid of uh, them getting so dirty, being that I have little kids and where I stay, it's very dusty, especially during the dry season. Uh, so yeah, but these curtains have never failed me. They they can stay on the windows even two months if you want to and they will never show that yeah so these are the best white curtains you can ever get so let me just remove these curtains actually nicolette and yvonne had removed the hard spot clean the carpet and removed it outside so they have just cleaned the whole sitting room the whole living room uh pushed the chairs and cleaned even behind the chairs the seats so uh i just woke up and uh, realized i need to clean the curtains before we do a deep clean so let me just remove them i'm now removing my bedroom curtain because i need this 
these uh, gold curtains to go, I need to switch them to the living room. That's what I normally do. I switch the whites and the golds in the living room and my bedroom. So I need to clean them, including the shears. Then uh, maybe uh, tomorrow or the day after, we can do a deep clean of my living room with them. Yeah. My shears will be the last uh, thing to wash, so I just want to soak them uh, as the curtains wash. I think the curtains will go in three uh, batches, that is three washes, so the shears uh, will have uh, soaked enough, so I'll do the shears as the fourth uh, wash, yeah. So I just want to soak them so that uh, in jig and uh, the detergent so that when I put them in the machine, they can come out sparkling clean. Got me out in the open. Now I'm ready to dive in. I know you told you it would be a slow burn.
I'm done with the laundry and I just want to clean my machine. It's been a while since I did this and uh, I just felt that it's quite dirty and I really need to do the cleaning. I don't have the tub cleaners but I will just use the normal uh, washing uh, machine powder or soap that I use for laundry. So first of all I'm removing this um, soap uh, dispenser. Uh, yeah, soap dispenser, and then I'm rem I'm also removing uh, the drainage thing uh, down at the machine, and then I'm using this uh, toothbrush that you don't use uh, to scrub inside uh, inside this part where we normally put the the detergent. Yeah, and then I will just uh, I will just spray it uh, afterwards with some vinegar and uh, clean with a. Uh, a cloth inside.
I want to clean the tub, but first of all, I'm cleaning this rubber. I'm trying to just wipe wipe off the dirt that normally looks like mud uh, below the rubber uh, before I before I put my tub into the cleaning mode. Yeah, so I'll just wipe uh, below the rubber so well so that I make sure there is no, the dirt is loose. Yeah, if you if you lift your rubber on the machine, you'll see that below the rubber, there's always some muddiness or uh, will I say some, yeah, dirt, brownness things. Yeah, I don't know how to call it, but there, there are things like that below the rubber due to the dirty clothes that you normally you normally clean or the mats yeah sometimes the mats or the shoes yeah so i will clean it and then i will just uh, put the tub into cleaning mode i will use vinegar and uh, my washing uh, my laundry powder then i uh, set it on tub clean and let it wash until it stops so after doing that i'll just go ahead and uh, clean my laundry space uh, le let me know guys how you clean uh, below your washing machines because i tried lifting this uh, washing machine so that i move it and clean this space but guys this thing is heavy this thing is heavy. You can't even lift it. Let me know how you do it, guys. Let me know. Just give me a hint because I really need to clean this uh, space below here. I need to clean below this machine. I really tried lifting it up, but I just cooled it. Yeah, so that is what happened. But I, I will later, I will then clean the laundry area where I normally store my detergents and all that. You've been broken down Heart is beating, still won't make a sound It feels like an angel straight from heaven Just like my lucky number seven You're my shooting star We're running around in circles Love feels so invincible Feel you when there's no one around
right now my tab is cleaning and uh, I'm just uh, I'm just leaving it this way as I clean and organize my my laundry area After one or two hours, the tub was done, and so I had to wipe the drum to dry. I had to wipe the drum. Yeah, I wanted it completely dry, and then I wiped the door and just left the machine open. I didn't leave the door wide open because where I've put my machine, the kids normally pass here a lot, so I normally just leave it a little bit open yeah so that they don't hit the door yeah that is what i did and uh, i was happy that i had done this i really planned to do this uh, but i wasn't getting time to do the cleaning but today i just had to sacrifice and finish up everything by myself so i'm happy i did this and guys if you um you haven't washed your machine, try and clean it because it accumulates dirt and later on at the pipe, the drainage pipe removes very dirty water. So thank you so much for watching. See you in my next one, guys. Goodbye.